My name is Ron Sievert. I'm the president and CEO of the Space Needle. The, the Space Needle opened to the public uh, April 21st of 1962. And as we head towards 2012, that would be our 50th year. We really wanted to, to, to do something just, uh, uh, just amazing. And the way we found the motivation to understand what that was going to be was to go back to the very first, the, the genesis of, of why the Space Needle was even built. So you put yourself in this mindset of 1960, 1961, 1962, and it was the dawn of the, the space race. And it was clear to us that as the shuttle program starts to wind down, and as we kind of wrap up that first 50 year era of space travel, that what was next was going to be the capability for the average citizen to, to enjoy space travel. And so the Space Needle is going to run a competition over the next several months where we will put an average citizen, uh, somebody just like me, somebody just like you, into a suborbital uh, space flight. I'm very excited by the Space Needle's uh, space race uh, of 2012 to be able to uh, uh, put a person in a suborbital flight. The opportunity that the Space Needle is providing uh, begins to fulfill the vision of the space program over 50 years ago. There is truly nothing like launching on a rocket, seeing the Earth from space, and returning uh, by reentering the Earth's atmosphere. I mean, it is truly a life-changing event, you know, like no other. To experience a few minutes of weightlessness and to see that view, maybe the only view on Earth that's better than the Space Needle's view, and the lucky winner uh, who's able to go on this will be will get their astronaut wings. They will be someone who's left the bonds of Earth and has actually joined the ranks of, of the private astronauts. Space Race 2012 is what we have, have dubbed this competition. So what began in the early 60s as an optimistic homage to, uh, to the Space Race hits a second stage here today as we begin to celebrate our 50th anniversary by helping to fuel the next phase of space travel one in which private citizens can travel to space almost as easily as they can explore the furthest reaches of our own planet. The program will give the average citizen, albeit one with a very adventurous soul, the opportunity to literally rocket into space, see the curvature of the Earth, see the thin blue line in the blackness of space. So beginning today, people from all over the country can participate in this opportunity of a lifetime. We're very excited about that. Thank you all very much for, for joining us today, and uh, here we go. Thank you.